Okay, so this is my electrolysis setup. I've got a battery tender hiding underneath this brick, connected down here um, to the positive and the negative terminals. Negative runs back here to this jumper cable hookup. Positive runs right here, connects to the uh, connects to the piece of metal that's inside there. I'm using uh, yellow electric tape as an insulator. Um, I can't let the steel touch the tank at all. Um, if I do, it'll short out. So wrap up any place where the uh, where the steel would be touching the tank. The tip of the uh, the tip of the steel is in there somewhere and, uh, and it's bound up too so it can rest easily and I don't have to worry about keeping it exactly, you know, not touching anything inside and just insulate the tips that do touch. So um, now I've done it a couple times, there's some rust deposits, you know, all over. This is new rust from this morning that hasn't dried yet, but we're going to go ahead and connect this up. We'll be able to tell that there's, there's current running because we'll get a few little sparks as we hook it up. Great, and then we can look right down here and see, we're starting to see bubbles. And that means that our electrolysis has begun. There it is. Great. Okay, I had a problem with my battery charger clicking off um, every once in a while. Um, it was cutting out and not really doing a very good job of still reacting. Um, and so I thought that uh, it would, in order to keep the current flowing um, and keep the battery charger from overloading itself, um, I took my matter battery out of my motorcycle and put that in line with the circuit. So the electrolysis system is drawing power off the battery and the battery is constantly being recharged by the charger um, so there's not a direct flow from the, the wall straight to the uh, straight to the to the tank system um, we have a little bit of a, a buffer in here to make sure that the current is always flowing um, it seems to be working out a whole lot better love science clean my tank science Appreciate it. See you in about eight hours.